Hi, hello, namaste. My name is Abhishek Patha. This is MVC Part 8. In this MVC Part 8, we will be seeing some important MVC topics. So, first will be understanding LinkQ, understanding entity framework and its approach, use of database first approach and MVC interview questions for this MVC Part 8. So, if you remember in part 7, we understood some important topics. Those important topics were understanding the root config and global.sx, create controller action and view with model. So, we understood the model, how we can use the model. Now, uh, in this MVC part 8, we will be seeing how we can use the model because we were uh, using some dummy data to display the model data now we have to use from database so let's understand the first topic that is understanding link queue so what is link queue so link queue is language integrated integrated query allows writing queries even without the knowledge of query language like sql xml etc link queue queries can be written for driver's data types uh, diverse data types so what does it mean so earlier um, every dotnet developer generally knows the sql but as we move on uh, different types of data different database like oracle db2 mysql were introduced so the difficulty is that uh, one developer cannot learn all the database to overcome those, those problem Microsoft introduced link queue. So same link queue query will work for all other database if that database is being supported by Microsoft. Okay, so the types of uh, link queue are so there are five types of link queue are available. First one is link queue to objects, link queue to XML. So when you have requirement where you want to uh, link uh, query on uh, XML, then we can use the link queue link you to data set link you to x sql and link you to entities link you to sql means if you want to connect to sql server uh, then generally uh, people can use uh, link you to sql and when uh, link you to sql uh, is used so the extension of that particular file is dot dbml okay remember dbml file and when we are using entity framework link you to entities so dot edmx file is generated so by seeing the extension of that particular file we can determine uh, whether uh, that project is being is using uh, link you to sql or link you to entities okay so understanding link you so next is the understanding entity framework and its approach so let's move to another slide so as i said uh, entity framework is a uh, type of link queue but when we are using entity framework in entity framework we can use the different approach to connect to database and fetch the values so generally uh, when we talk about approaches so there are three approaches can be used with entity framework first one is a database first in this approach we create the entity framework using existing database means what we have to do first we have to create the database then we have to write the code so, uh, so for example uh, once your tables are ready then uh, we can use the database first approach second one is code first in this uh, what we do in this we create the classes and from from those classes we generate the database so in this case in uh, code first what we have to do we have to write the first code then from those code or those classes from those classes we can generate the database third one is model first so uh, what is model first in this approach database model is first created in entity framework once efs entity framework once database model is generated with properties and relationship then uh, from those physical uh, then from that mo model we can uh, generate the database so in this case first we write the model then those models uh, 
can be considered for our database tables okay so uh, this is the second topic which i wanted to cover understanding link queue understanding entity framework and its approach and a use of database first okay so okay and uh, uh, use of database first so uh, in upcoming videos what we will be doing we will be uh, creating uh, the mvc application using this database first approach of entity framework then later we will be seeing uh, those two code first and model first also and uh, third or uh, last topic was mvc interview questions so uh, like um, what questions can be asked so first one is what is link queue so what is link queue link queue is a language integrated query which allows us to write the query even without the knowledge of query language like sql xml etc so if you are using sql oracle db2 or any other database so you don't need to worry about that particular uh, syntax for that database same query will work for all the database okay so let's see what is uh, types of link queue so what are the types of link queue there are five types of link queue link queue to objects link queue to xml link queue to database link queue to sql and link queue to D, uh, entities and we will be concentrating on this last one link link queue to entities or link queue to entity framework okay yeah so how will you determine if link you to SQL or link you to entity framework is used in your project? So as I explained, uh, if you see the .dbml file in your project, so it means you are using the link you to SQL. And when you see uh, the .edmx file, so you are using the link you to entities framework okay let's see what different type of approaches in entity framework so uh, three approaches are there database first code first model first and uh, which approach you used in your project so that is um, a practical one if uh, generally sometime in interview uh, you can be asked uh, which approach you have used in your uh, project so if you have used a database course first or model first so it's your individual answer explain the model first database first code first approach so uh, in this uh, video i have explained the basic thing the definition only in upcoming videos we will be seeing this uh, database first approach and then later we will see uh, what are code first and model first and how we can use uh, this uh, approach with mvc okay i hope you have liked uh, my video uh, please subscribe share and if you have any questions related to mvc please uh, uh, you can mail me you can give me a comment and in next video we will be seeing the uh, this topic uh, database first with mvc thanks for watching my video thanks bye